And a couple things there. The reason we de I just stepped in a little coolant. The reason we deburr that thread and do a cleanup pass is if we were to turn and thread, you're going to have burrs here and you're going to have them in the back. Someone would say, hey, Luke, why are you going to have burrs? I don't know. It's just the rule. It's just what happens. A thread throws up a burr on both sides of it. So we go back in there with the groove, hit the undercut or the thread relief like it is on the print. But then we also come here and deburr the front. And then we do what we call a spring pass or a cleanup pass that cleans up that thread. That way when you're done, as I had showed in the beginning, smooth. Smooth as butter is what I say. A nice smooth, clean thread. And we do that same thing on the subside. We go in there, we bore it, we thread it, single point thread, we rebore, and then we go back and we re-thread. That way, when we go to start our thread gauge, smooth. If you didn't go in there and deburr and re-thread, when you go to put that gauge on there, there's gonna be a little bit of a burr. It's what we call a, a hang up. It's a little bit of sharp edge. The gauge won't go well. So we deburr it. Let's watch that run.